Hey guys, my name is Tectonic Wolf, and today I'm going to show you how to download Megasync. So, what Megasync is basically is um, an application by Mega which allows you to download any files from Mega to ins using that application, and it's reasonably faster than downloading it through your browser, as I have seen. So, yeah, that's basically what it is. So, today I'm going to show you how you can download it and download files with it so first what you want to do is go to the mega um, mega website and go to the menu thing here just click on it and this thing will come up and I'll leave a link for the website in the description below so what you want to do is go to apps click on sync client and download free download for Windows and if you have Mac or Linux you can just click down there but uh, I'm using Windows as you can see you just had to wait for it to download so I already have it downloaded so I'm just gonna use the one I have downloaded so yeah. so yeah let me just open it up okay so uh, th there it is it should be in your download files if it's not in your download files and it's uh, somewhere else and you can just click on this thing for uh, Chrome and just click on the show in folder uh, thing and it'll, and it'll bring up the folder that it's in nope okay whatever so what, then what you want to do is click mega sync setup the exe just click it wait for it to open press run press yes click select your language um, I'm in gonna take English uh, next you can read the terms and conditions and press agree um, you can and click install for everyone for for if you click on install for anyone using this computer is like um, if you have a different uh, user account on Windows 8 or other things or Windows 7 then it will install for all of them or install just for me is only for that user account so I'm just gonna click on all of them so next install it will just take a few minutes and it will be done And it's fine if it goes like that, cause it's just um, it won't. I don't think it'll happen for all computers, but some of them is like just refreshing, so the app will be there. Okay, click uh, check. Make sure that's checked. Press finish. Okay, and if you don't have a Mega account, click on this. Um, or if you do have a Mega account, click on this. Uh, but I will show you if how to make a mega account if you don't have one. Just click on this tab and fill out this, fill this out. Click that, agree, next, and uh, verify your email and stuff. And then just come back to, and then just log in. Um, I'm gonna log in and I'll be back. Once you've logged in, you will be prompted with um, this. A window and it will s and you can choose whether you want full sync or selective sync um, I'm just gonna click on full sync press next and you can change the location but I'm just gonna keep it like that press next again and finish so now that you have your me mega sync running you just had to open it up and then what you want to do is go to your download from mega one of your mega downloads that you want to download or the one that you want to download it's basically the same thing but whatever and you should click download with mega sync
just clicking it. Not sure what's wrong. Okay, there you go. So, and then you'll be prompted with this. Um, you can change the destination if you want. Just click that uh, screen button, this thing, and press OK. And the download should start downloading. Um, might take some time. Okay, there you go. See, it's downloading, and um, it's estimated time. And yeah, it's, uh, I doubt it's actually going to take six or seven hours. But yeah, that's how you install and use MegaSync. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and find it useful. This is Tectonic Wolf signing out. Yeah.